What's up, YouTube? And what you know? My name is Domino with the Zero, and welcome to episode three of our Pokemon Red and Blue Mystery Dungeon Co-op with Neighbor. Say hello. Hello. Thank you for saying hello. You're In welcome. the last episode, episode number three, episode number. The last episode, episode number two, was it 2A or 2B? So in the last episode, we uh, we woke up, we went on our first mission as a rescue team, and that was to save a Magnemite. Uh, and then we explored the Pokemon Square out here. Uh, if you do want to check that out, make sure you click the icon up at the top right of the screen. In today's episode, we're going to be making our way over to... Um, the Pelipper post office, and, and then continuing on from there. So if you're excited for this episode, make sure to hit the like button down below. Do subscribe to become a member of the Domination. And I feel like I for keep forgetting something. But I'm going to go ahead and say question of the day. Since we're starting a Pokemon Mystery Dungeon, what is your favorite not main series Pokemon game? So that could be things like what? It could be Pinball. It could be Conquest. Why was Pinball the first one you chose? Because that's as wild as it gets. All if right. it has Pokemon on the name, you can pick it. Pokemon Pinball, Pokemon Conquest, Pokemon Go. Okay. Pokemon Tournament. I like Pokemon that Pokemon Mystery Dungeon. Okay. It could be the Pokemon Coliseum games. Yes. It could be Stadium 1 or 2. It could be... Where is 3? For real. It could be Snap. Pokemon Let's Snap. Let's not forget Snap. Where's Pokemon Snap 2? Um... Uh, the Rotom decks in Pokemon Sun and Moon with uh, Pokefinder. Yeah, sure. That's anyway. Over to the Pelipper <laughs> office we go. Ooh, ooh, that crept up on him. That building is the Pelipper post office. Oh, look at how beautiful it is. Thank God it's off. The oh God. <laughs> This is where information is gathered from Pokemon needing rescue in various locations. See, have a look at this bulletin board. It lists rescue jobs. Check it out. Bulletin board. Oh my gosh, look at all of these. So, because there are three things for me to do with Thunderwave Cave and only two things to do with Tiny Woods, I'm going to pick up as many Thunderwave Cave things as I can. Yep, and we're going to do all three in this episode. Actually, that'd be really easy. I don't know why I'm making that sound so hype. See, First, there were though, jobs listed, right? To do a rescue, you must select it with... I'm accepting all of them because these disappear the next day. And this one has an elixir of the reward, so maybe if another day there's more tiny wood stuff. Is that how that works? Like, we're just going to have a list of jobs that we're doing? That's the way this works. To do a rescue job, you first select it with accept, then on the jobs... Okay, we, we know how to play If we game. move far enough in the game that an elixir's not that good and tiny woods isn't somewhere I'm trying to explore, we can always ditch them. Okay, th thank you for, okay. I'm gonna go ahead and accept these as well. Now, is there, there's nothing to do inside here, is there? You get to talk to the most beautiful creatures. But mostly I think those are, why are you still talking? That's what I was saying. All right, so we're gonna head off to the Thunder Wave Cave. Bzz, bzz. Yeah. Buzz, buzz. All right. Oh, wait. I didn't accept them. Did you accept them? No. Wait. Take job. Take job. Take so, job. Is there a way for me to leave? No, because that's a special item. I think maybe we're going to have me run through this real quick. And we'll cut. <laughs> what? <laughs> Now we've returned with none other than the <laughs> Mystery Dungeon Master himself, so Neighbor joining us. Um, neighbor ran through the Thunder Wave Cave, all six floors of it, and progressed in the story. <laughs> oh, while well, I sat here like this. I'm an expert because I don't waste any time. <laughs> I run through. And now he's... No, He's I'm already not. back there, and I'm just now getting set off. So here we, at, here we go. On to the Thunder Wave Cave. To complete some missions this time. Now, what was our question of the day? Because it was like 35 minutes ago that we came up with it. Our question of the day. 
was what is your favorite spinoff? Oh, that's right. That's not, right. That's not right, that's main right. series. So what would you say yours is? Mine's probably Mystery Dungeon. Over it, Coliseum and... Yeah, because I mean, as much as I love those games, they still felt like samey enough for them to be like... I don't really consider them that different. Oh, okay. Yeah. You were kind of against considering those yeah. in well, the mean, running anyway. Ah. Yeah. But I mean, they make, they make sense. Because I feel like Coliseum is like a battle sim, so if you like Pokemon battles, like that's like saying Pokemon Showdown is my favorite. Which, I don't blame you. It's great. Uh, I like this whole linked moves thing. It's super good. I cannot think of... I don't know. I, I really like these games. Um, they give you like a different perspective of a lot of Pokemon. Yes, for sure. Dude, I mean, that's exactly what uh, Pokémon does. I would say it's exactly what Pokémon does. I mean, it takes a whole lot of Pokemon. It's uh, let me try that. Can again. I say Super Smash Brothers? <laughs> hey, is that a Pokemon spinoff game? It's got Pokemon in it. <laughs> I don't remember what the jobs that I had to do were. How can I find the jobs I have to do? You go to mission objectives. Okay. Three, four, and five. Are we exploring the entire floor and I'm three, we three, just going straight to and find apple? Are we going straight to the floors like when we do this or Um I'm still exploring a little bit because I like finding stuff. I also have to find an apple. That's part of my You have to find an apple? No. That's I fun. think it might be a good idea if we go straight to the floors that we have missions on. Oh, well, I found an apple. I hope there's nothing extra that I have to do with that apple, because I was not paying attention. Just in case, even though I have the option of leaving once I'm done with a with the thing, I think I'm going to go all the way to six. Does that make sense? Yeah. I just want to see if we can do more than just like this single dungeon in this uh, episode. Mission objectives. Rescue Elekid. Oh, there he is. Are we on the third floor already? Yes. I don't so know why this Rattata is running away from me. Leave now? No. Continue with your adventure? Yes. Now, I wish that it would tell me, when I look at miss mission objective, other than find Apple, is there like a Pokemon that I have to find on this floor to give the Apple to? Is there... I found another Apple. Who am I saving on this floor? Reach the destination floor. Okay. I have to rescue Nidoran. Oh, I have found you, Voltorb. Voltorb, come here. Voltorb, hither. I feel like sometimes they don't want to be saved. I sh I showed my light mm -hmm. on Boltorb and he escaped. I would That's not your, like uh... to leave. Yes, I would like to continue. I wish you wouldn't default my answers to the to the wrong ones. Same problem that I just had. Peter was found. Yes. I, I found an apple mission. also, but that's not my mission. I think my next mission is on the third floor or the fourth floor, and then I have a mission on the fourth floor as well or fifth floor. I have missions on three, four, and five. That's what I'm okay. saying. It's probably good that I'm a little bit ahead of you then, because I, like, I just finished my fourth floor mission. But if I plan to go all the way to floor six, then you're done at floor five. I don't want to keep you waiting. Ah, I'm breaking my, I'm breaking my patterns or my usual, my usual routines in mystery dungeon games. I don't like to cut through the middle. I like to go through the outside of the game first. It makes it easier to find your way around. Figure out where the heck you're going. Trico, use absorb. Literally used absorb right as I called out to. I'm level nines now. Same. I thought you were ahead of me because of you. Oh, never mind. You used <laughs> I, I totally forgot that. Anyway. All right, fourth floor. I have to save somebody else here, I think. Russell picked up the apple. 
Where's that plus hole? Because I'm going to smack it in the face. Plus hole, more like dead. Ha, <laughs> good one. <laughs> oh, that's right. We have to go see these guys at the Pelipper office. Yep, as okay. soon as you're done, you go there. Got to be really careful when I hit, when, when I complete a mission, not to just mash, mash through it, or I'll, I'll wind up leaving and failing the other missions. Okay, so I'm done. I ran through. Okay. I'll, uh... I kind of speed ran it because I didn't want to make you wait. That seems to have backfired a little that bit. That seems to have backfired. That's the plus with the money. I know it is. With the money or the apple? Is there a different one with the money? I thought you said you had an apple. You had an apple. I wasn't even looking at your screen. Alright, where do I go? Uh, it doesn't even matter because I. Both ways of the ground. Getting hungry. You can make it. I think getting hungry means you're at 20 or below. And I have one floor left. Yeah, and at 10 or below, you start taking damage. Reach destination floor. Ugh. Oh! The growls keep missing. Ooh. Link moves are almost out of PP? Yeah. So if one of your linked moves runs out of PP but the other one doesn't, they become unlinked. It said I think you have two more uses. You can also check by going into your... Yeah. Whatever. I think um, that means your toolbox is full. But I don't know if you need this thing. And then Wurmple was found. Yes. Honestly, you don't even have to say yes. Yes, right here. You can walk up to those stairs. No. Yes. <laughs> Continuing like a man. That's right. All right, we are through the Thunder Wave Cave. Thank you for risk. Oh, here's your reward. The promise. Grab a rock ten. I got a hundred pokey. Yeah. Five Woo! rescue points. We got a max elixir. Yeah. I wish I got a max elixir. 100 pokey from the second one. Thank you for rescuing me! Max okay, oh, I did get a max elixir. I got a gravel rock 10. I would like a gravel rock 10. I just got 100... Oh! A lot of max elixirs. You got 100% what? I got a reviver seed. What's up? What's up? What you know about my reviver seed? Nothing. I didn't get any reviver seeds. What I got you, a lot of max elixirs. What you elixir. get that said something about 100%? 100 pokey. Oh! Didn't we do good today? Let's call it a night and get some rest. Okay, see you tomorrow. Nice one-sided conversation. <laughs> yes, I would like to... Oh. I'm going to hit no. <laughs> I don't want to save. Why don't uh, you want to save? <laughs> no reason. Can't imagine why. Why anyone would ever not want to save. Hmm. Hmm. Again? Am I dreaming again? Wait, is this when the... It's that Pokemon again. Huh? They're talking to me? I can't hear them clearly. What are they saying? Huh? It's it's shaking. An earthquake? Whoa, it's getting worse. For a dream, this feels strangely real, but... <laughs> neutral face, neutral face, neutral face. The next morning. Ah, uh, hello. Did I need a lower voice for that? I have a feeling I needed a lower voice. Huh? Uh, you are Domino, aren't you? I feel like uh, your voice, your first voice was good. If uh, this oh, is what I think it is. You can't see, of course. You can't see us, of course. How very rude of us. Oh. Trio, Trio, Trio. We're pleased to meet you. We are Doug Trio. Last night, during the earthquake, our child Diglett was attacked. He was wished away to the peak of a tall mountain. We couldn't possibly climb somewhere so high. That's why I must call upon you for help, Domino. Diglett was abducted by a Pokemon named Skarmory. It is a vicious, vilely vicious ruffian. Please be, do be careful. Please, we need your help. We must go. <laughs> what kind of vilely vicious ruffian? Jeez. That guy was like, that That Doug Trio must have been the same person that wrote the, um, the song about the Grinch. Yeah, just about. He said, stink, stink, stunk. 
<laughs> that was so sudden, there was no time to even say no. It's too bad, I better go. I was planning on saying no. <laughs> That's exactly what he just said. That's a little wild. All right, let's continue on just a little bit. Let's see, let's see what our partner has planned. Good morning, uh, Dama Neighbor. Huh? You were just asked to go on a rescue mission. Yes! <laughs> our child, Diglett, was kidnapped. He was taken to Mount Steel's summit. Please, we need your help. Trio, trio, trio. That's not a good trio voice, but that's okay. Uh, okay. Let's go. <laughs> same. Probably same. Wait. I don't, I don't think I actually progressed the game last time. What do you say we run through and do these real quick? Ooh. Or shall we yeah, go check and see if there's any more? Yeah, let's check and see if there's any more. And then do that real quick, because we can't progress without um, helping that lost poor child. Okay, that's it. There's only those two. So let's do those two real fast, and then we'll call it an episode there. We're still, we're still, we're still, we're still trying to figure out how we want to do progress. All of the stuff that's like in the game, while also making it more like. I didn't accept those. It's a good thing Tiny Woods is like three floors. I'm not. I'm not going back. No, you, <laughs> I'll do that off screen. I'll do that off screen. Trico, smack him! Oh god. I mean, if you can get through it, then go ahead and get through it. It's like three floors. Oh wow. I am quick. You get to see the speed run of the sentry over on the left side of the screen. It's so weird being on the right side of the screen. Because I'm a lefty, so everything in my life has always been left. Okay, this growl, his attack. I finished. His attack, <laughs> did, his attack did one. It did one. All right. There better be some good, good dang. Whatever I was trying to say before I got sidetracked. Uh, I'm running. Morning, let's do good today. Helper! Running. I feel like uh, I set a new world record on, on Fastest Tiny Woods, to be honest. Maybe. You might have set a record. I don't know, it was pretty suboptimal, but I'm already on floor two. <laughs> Is that where your mission is? Yep. Wow, and there's a... The, the mission was right there? Yeah, and as well as the stairs. Okay, well now I'm on to the third floor for my second mission. Me also. I'm, I'm the speedrun champion. Oh, I forgot to drop stuff off. Oh, you've got a full bag? That's alright, there's nothing really good on this floors. Alright, well I'm gonna go ahead and end, I'm gonna go ahead and leave here so I can, uh... Yes. I'm gonna go ahead and leave so I can deposit stuff, and then we'll call it the episode. Let's see, I got... I got another Max Elixir. Oh. And... 100%. 100%. I got 100 Pokey and a Max Elixir and 5 Rescue Points and Max Elixir and Gravel Rock 10 and Rescue Points. So, next time we get to see why Cubone Run is the hardest thing ever. Oh, I understand. Is there, is a big boss next time? I mean... I'm not going to say anything, but uh, we did learn that Scar Marie just kidnapped a Doug Diglett. How does that work? <laughs> Snatched it up out from under the ground and flew away with it. Whoa. Anyway, we're going to go ahead and call it an episode right there. In today's episode, we did manage to take two dungeons of missions. We're becoming the domination. How oh, perfect. Anyway, uh... Becoming the domination here in game for reals. In the next episode, as Neighbor said, we are going to be making our way to Mount Steel. 
Mount Steel. To track down this little Doug Trio. Or little Diglett. Diglett. For, for the Doug Trio. Doug Trio. If you enjoyed today's episode, make sure to hit the like button down below. And do subscribe to become a member of the Domination yourself. We will see you in the next episode. Until then, have a blessed day. <laughs>